Being brave is not always something you feel. It's something you do. You do it in the face of fear and unknown outcomes and risks you don't really want to take. You do it when your enemy is staring you down with taunting statements of defeat. You do it not to prove there's something great inside of you. You do it because if you don't, something will die inside of you. You do brave things because it's time to rise up and speak up and let truth find its freedom with your voice. What knocked you down won't keep you down. What happened was wrong. Acknowledge it, speak it, cry over it, but don't die over it. You've been hurt, but you don't have to live hurt. You do brave things because you were made to connect, not with all people, but with the right people. Take right risks, take it slow, but don't stop, don't withdraw, don't disappear. You do brave things because you are a woman who can kneel humbly and rise intentionally. You will find good people and good people will find you. And you'll do brave until you become brave. You'll know love again. You'll know laughter again. And you'll know deep in your bones that you don't waste all that you've learned. Those spilled tears, every one of them, was you letting go of the pain to make room for possibility. Your life is not a tragedy. It's a testimony that God is your rock and your redeemer. And if your hands are shaking, let it only be because you're pointing at the devil who picked the wrong girl to mess with this time. Don't wait until you feel brave. Go be brave. Remember, if God is for you, there is nothing that can stand against you.